Uh, Nathan, welcome back from your work project. So, Nathan, behind the curtain here, at the time of this recording, we're in the middle of the month. Uh, during this month, Nathan has been away, and because of that, I haven't been able to record or see him or talk to him because he's been out in the wilderness uh, working with some uh, camps and teen groups and things like that, doing some filming and stuff. So, But, Nathan, while you were gone, there was a little bit of drama in Beyonce land. Oh, in the beehive. In the, in the, yes, right, it is Beehive, and I have incorrectly called it Beehive, so I want to apologize for that, so don't add us. I'll... Apparently, okay, remember when we did those two songs from Cowboy Carter? The one with uh... Post Malone, the one with Miley Cyrus? Okay, yeah. Yep. It was from a patron, and this poor patron, she is such a love... If people knew who she was, they probably would have been so passionate about their opinions about us doing something so far into the future of Beyonce's catalog. Okay. Okay. So long story short, I won't be I won't belay this. I, I know you don't like to get too wrapped up in this, but long story short, people got really I mean Nathan, they were so bent out of shape, it was like we insulted Beyonce. Oh wow. Like, yeah, yeah, it was that passionate. It was they why are like before the videos even got released. <laughs> oh, before oh, they no even way. got released, they were like oh. commenting in the comment section, you know, before the premiere. Oh why are we here? <laughs> <laughs> Like, because <laughs> because someone paid for it, exactly. So, but Angela, she doesn't really follow the channel. Channel, mm. like she doesn't follow. She didn't even know that mm. we were doing Beyonce. She oh. has like she yeah. she has like health issues and stuff. So this is why I wish people you got to be. This is why people have to be very considered and careful what they say on on social media, mm. because they don't know who they're talking to. So this patron has health issues. I won't say what they are, but they're not able just to always go online. Like they often will purge their requests that their monthly requests all at once because they have a a time or period in their life where they can kind of hey can you do these songs it's been mm -hmm. a few months because i'm able to talk and type and here you go mm -hmm. and focus on this stupid channel <laughs> and here you go so she didn't even know we were doing the beyonce she just thought hey i think you guys might like a couple beyonce songs that was it and so it just so happened we're doing the beyonce journey she gave mm -hmm. us these requests and our patrons always come first Hmm. We had people saying, Nathan, how come you just don't put it, uh, leave it on Patreon? The, because the people that pay for the reactions, they actually want to see, but they want to see people's comments on YouTube. <laughs> so I went online and I just gave a little like, hey, the, what we're doing is X, Y, Z. And people know that now, but it's still funny how, so long story short, Nathan and I are going through Beyonce, started with album four, all the journey forward, every song from every album, every live performance is worth watching in that time period of that album's release documentaries the live concerts we're gonna go the journey until we get sick of it who knows mm. we might tap out but so far we're having fun we're having mm. a good time the only thing we're not having a good time with is the people's <laughs> passionate comments that's exhausting that's okay that's it's like the star trek of uh beyonce really right it's like the Trekkies are so passionate about it, and if you get some of the lore wrong, they're like, Bruh! "Yeah, that's, that's what's happening." That's yeah, happening. I mean, look, it's a fandom. I get it, and I understand they're passionate about their artist. I get it, and we are too enjoying this. It's just I'm just letting you. Know, I'm just being honest with my best friend. I haven't talked to Nathan in two weeks, so I'm part of me. A part of this, Nathan. I'm sorry. Is just giving this to you because I missed you. I haven't had a chance to talk to you about this. I've been trying to uh, assuage as best I can these people. <laughs> <laughs> keep it the cathartic you're just getting this out so that the whole world can hear it okay the keeping the hounds at bay so okay. so nathan we are doing the concert you ready to go act one uh okay. i don't know what what else to say other than let's just get going let's uh let's do it yeah <laughs> 